Hello friends, Jerry Rosa here in the Rosa Stringworks Workshop. It's been uh, about two weeks now since I was able to put out a video, and that's because we were in Italy. Uh, it's always been a lifelong dream to go to Italy, and uh, my sure name, Rosa, is uh, of Italian descent. And uh, my relatives came over from Italy back in the very early 1800s, around 1817, somewhere in there and uh, then migrated to Missouri not too long after that and have been in Missouri pretty much ever since. So uh, we're more or less hillbilly Italians. <laughs> but we did get to go back and uh, see the country and it was absolutely beautiful. Now the traveling to and from not so much. Uh, lost our luggage, uh, you name it, every flight was delayed by a lot. Uh, the lines in Heathrow were forever long, <laughs> just unbelievable. I mean, hours in line. Not, not one hour, not two hours, hours. Three, four hours in line. It was just terrible. I've never seen anything like it. I think the day that we were there, 800 people were in a line that had missed flights, <laughs> and we were at the end of the line. <laughs> it was terrible. It was just terrible. The country was beautiful, and uh, I really can't tell you how wonderful it was. Uh, we went to quite a few places. Uh, we went to Venice. We went to Cremona, where they built the Stradivari and Amati violins, and many others, of course. And uh, we spent time in Cisliano, which is where the family we were staying with lived, and uh, Milan, and, um, oh, I don't know, we went to a... Uh, marble quarry which uh you know you might think well why would you go to a marble quarry well i'm interested in things how things are made and built and uh we was up in the high mountains and i that was one of the highlights for me i mean really it was and of course everybody there really likes all the food and everything people go there for what food fashion and wine those three things are absolutely on the very bottom of my list <laughs> I'm not a food person, I'm not a fashion person at all, as you can tell, and uh, you know, it's uh, the wine thing, I don't drink, so that didn't excite me either. Now their cheeses were pretty darn good, and uh, their pastas and their uh, breads were real good too, so I was, uh, you know, but I, like I said, the food thing wasn't even of interest to me. Uh, you know, we had, we went to uh, Pisa, the Leaning Tower, of course, and uh, uh, the uh, Cinque Terre, which is the five cities that have, uh, that are right on the cliffs of the ocean, or, well, of the sea, uh, the Adriatic Sea, I guess it is, there in the Mediterranean. But uh, anyway, though, it was beautiful, just had a good time. Um, however, you might not be seeing too many actual working videos for a little while, um, because I have got a bucket load of stuff that's broke here on the farm. I, this is just a very short list, and trust me, there's three times this much, but both air conditioners in the main house are having trouble. One of them's still working, but doesn't turn off correctly. The other one doesn't put out any cold at all, so the main house is kind of warm. These are things we came back to. Um, like three broken windows. The renter broke one by accident and, and I mean he's a real good guy so it was just an accident. And uh, then my wife broke a couple of them with the weed eater <laughs> on the main house and uh, which I can't complain about. She does the weed eating so I'm not complaining. Um, we were out of propane so we don't have any hot water. That's what we use propane for. Our main TV, the big, it's only a 40 incher but it's uh, you know that one broke. Um, so I've got a part ordered for that. I think I can fix that myself, I think. My bobcat broke. Uh, that broke as we were leaving to go to Italy. I mean, like the very morning of, and uh, it wouldn't move. My son finally got it moving, but uh, now it needs a new battery. Uh, I also need new batteries for my solar charger, which works my internet service. <laughs> it's, it's, it's unbelievable how many things. and. To, to top it all off, I cut hay yesterday, and 30 minutes after I cut hay, now keep in mind, we're in the middle of a drought, 30 minutes after I cut hay, it rained like you wouldn't believe. And so, uh, it just, you know, I don't know. Italy was great, that's all I can tell you. <laughs> but uh, anyway, I'm just laughing to keep from crying, I think. Uh, so I may not be doing too many videos for a little while until I get some things caught up around here. 
I will say though that if you were holding up on orders, uh, there were several people that were holding up on orders and things uh, until I got back. Go ahead and ship them. There'll be no problem. We'll get on them just as quick as I can. I don't. I always make those things a priority. So even when I've got trouble on the farm here, those things become top priority. So if you were holding up on shipping me an instrument or, or a deposit or any of those kinds of things, feel free to go ahead and send them. Um, I will also... Uh, tell you that the people that were um, that ordered uh, CDs and DVDs while we were in Italy I, I was still corresponding and those have all been shipped those were shipped on Saturday so that should be no problem um, I'm going to go ahead the rest of this video is going to be on uh, pictures and video taken while we were in Italy I will try to uh, put some subtitles there and try to make some sense of it for you uh, I really uh, just think it was beautiful and if you've never been uh, maybe this will encourage you to go Hope you enjoy it. Thank you. Because they have a pretty famous film festival here. Oh yeah? Yeah, with all the... Uh...
stopped. He stopped. Now he's. He's going to turn around. Oh my gosh. He's going to come this way. Oh <laughs> my gosh. Oh. That's oh. why Marble uh, cost. This. Questo l'ho fatto la pietà di Michelangelo. Sì, sì. sì. Bolognini di Fontane. Mi, certo, Michelangelo è venuto qua lui, proprio lui col cavallo, perché non c'erano le automobili, è andato su in quelle cave lì, che non ha piedi, e insieme ai cavatori ha deciso di fare il giusto per fare la mia strada. Portatelo giù a Roma. Beh, adesso non tutto il marmo è venuto da qua, però gran parte, gran parte del, del marmo è venuto da qua. Uh. <ride> 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 Anna gaat hier weer omhoog.